Hi, I'm Julia Grace and I'm passionate about inspiring, educating and resourcing people on how to deal with their mental wellness in a way that's not going to bring you down. As the stress increased in my world, I began to feel more and more under that pressure and I began to feel burnout, burnt out like a beige feeling on the inside. And stress led to burnout and burnout led to anxiety, to panic attacks and clinical depression. I like to say my life is like a long series of getting knocked off my high horse and getting back on progressively smaller horses <laughs> and right now I'm saddling up a chihuahua. <laughs> now I know what you're thinking, talking about depression, stress, anxiety, burnout, not my idea of a good time, <laughs> I've got great news for you. Now I was brought up very British, very hardcore, my mother, post-war Barbara, practical woman. I said to her once, I said, what a spa pool, why can't we have a spa pool, everybody else has got a spa pool. That means one person I know has a spa pool, by the way, if you've got children. <laughs> my mother says, I'll give you a spa pool. She put me in the bath, in my togs, with an egg beater. <laughs> I share songs and stories and science that helps you to better understand how your brain works. Because let's face it, mental wellness is an issue that affects us all. I love using this model because it acknowledges that in every single human being, there's more to us than just one facet. One wall does not create a house. We are not disembodied spirits floating around in the atmosphere, praying for good health while sitting in the KFC line. <laughs> every breath we take is a mental wellness issue. If you're smiling, it's a mental wellness issue. It's quite a nice one. You might be feeling really well, but you can always get weller. Because you can tell a weller woman. <laughs> By the way, she wears her hair. In the last couple of years, I've spoken at over 150 events, sharing my own story honestly about my journey through mental wellness. I'll probably make you laugh, I'll possibly make you cry, but I'll definitely help you to understand better some tips and tools on dealing with your mental wellness. Um, you've heard of keep calm and carry on? Rubbish. <laughs> Great for the Blitz of London, not good for your mental health in 2019. So I've come up with a whole new slogan, are you ready? Make a big scene! <laughs> and carry on. <laughs> My husband Michael and I would love to connect with you and discuss how we can help you to tackle this important topic of mental wellness. Find out more at juliagrace.co.nz. I look forward to hearing from you. If you're walking through a fire, ladies, don't stop. It's not a good place for a picnic. <laughs> Maybe a barbecue, but you know. Um, <laughs> don't stop. My life is totally different to what I had expected and yet it is beautiful in its own unique way. So this is for the girl on the kitchen floor. I want to tell that girl that life will be beautiful again. I want to tell that girl that her days will be full of love again. And I've got my But in my heart of hearts, I know there is so much left to live for. Girl on the kitchen floor. Thank you so much.